Thank you very much for the time. My name is Masendra. I am from Department of Forest Product Technology, Universitas Gadjah Mada. Today, I would like to present my study about methanol soluble extractive of Pinus mercusii bug and its antioxidant activity. The introductions. The bug usually protects the living tissues in the trees. However, bug are rich in extractive such as polyphenolics and terpenes. These extractive are usually used as antioxidant agents. In Indonesia, the forest pine about 476,000 hectare and the forest pine is used to obtain oleoresin and wood. However, here there is a bug residue in high amounts. So the question is, is the bug from this pine contain extractive that can use for antioxidant? The next is the material and methods. This is the pine bug was powdered to four tea maize and then the bug was successfully extracted with enhexan, ethyl acetate, and methanol. This is the methanol extract of the bark of pine. is subjected for antioxidant, polyphenolic contents, and also GCMS. The antioxidant activity was conducted using DPPH method, and for GCMS analysis, the derivative TMCS was used to analyze the methanol soluble extract and the polyphenol contents including total phenol content, total flavonol content, and tannin formaldehyde. The total phenolic content or total phenol content is used by Polinsiocalteo method. Total flavonol content is conducted by vanillin HCL method and tannin formaldehyde is conducted according to Humphreys. This is the results and discussions. So the extractive content of N-hexan has been reported in previous work, while the ethyl acetate has not been reported. In here, the methanol extractive weight 2.6 or 0.26% of dried sample of pine bark. In table 1, we can see this is the DPPH scavenging activity of soluble methanol extract. So this is the concentration from 1000 ppm until 125 ppm. The IC50 of the soluble extract of methanol is around 1,400 and this is under mild activity compared to the quercetin around 47.1. The antioxidant activity of methanol soluble extract in this sample was higher than water soluble extract but was lower than acetone soluble extract of wood of Pinus mercusii. The next is the result and discussion of GCMS analysis. The phenolics of methanol soluble extract is around 3%. And we can see here, so many vanillin derivative was found. The presence of vanillin also was reported in Pinus brutia bark. And the next is sugar. Sugar is around 2% and beta uranosides is the higher. Also, we can see here dimanitol. The presence of dimanitol also was detected in the bark of Pinus oleotii, Pinus caribia, Pinus montezuma, and Pinus insularis. The next is the highest concentration of 
GCMS analysis from the methanol soluble extract, we can see here the fatty acids and alcohol around 40-54% with the methyl lignocerates and octacosic trimethylsilan dominated the fatty acids and, and, and alcohol. So in comparison, these results were different from a few study with involved analyzing six different venous bugs using the TCMS without the detection of fatty acids. The next is steroids compound. We can see here the sigma tendon and hydroxycholesterol dominated the steroids. And we can see here the isoquinoline derivative is only the one alkaloid detect in the bug sample. In comparison, previously the major stigma tendon also and hydroxycholesterol were found in bug of Venus caribia, Venus ocarpa, and Venus oleotii. The next result from previous work so the total phenol content, total flavonol content, and tannin formaldehyde of the bug of Venus mercosii was conducted in inner bug and outer bug. So we can see here the TPC of inner bug was lower than outer bug, but the TVC saw the opposite results. The F of outer bug around 0.4%. Unfortunately, the inner bug of the F was not determined. So based on a previous study, the phenol contents were also found in the bug of Venus Sandbergi, Venus Banksiana, Venus Radiata, and Venus Coriensis. This is the correlation between antioxidants and related compounds. As we know that phenolic compounds roll as antioxidant agents. However, in the methanol soluble extractive, the phenolic con compounds was lower compared to the fatty acid, steroids, and alcoholics. So, we suggest that these compounds also act as antioxidant agents. The next is correlation between phenol contents and the antioxidants. So we can see here the TVC show the higher level in inner bug than in outer bug. So maybe we can make saying that the high concentration of TVC in the inner bug and also the presence of the tannin formaldehyde indicated the flavonoid structure also plays as TPPH inhibitor. So in previous work, Ku et al. also reported that TPPH is correlated well with the phenol contents. The next is the clone question. We can say the antioxidant activity of the bug sample, especially the methanol extractive, is was 1452 microgram per milliliter and it was categorized under mild activity. GCMS analysis detected fatty acid and, al and alcohol as the dominant compounds, while phenolics and cigar were, were the minor compounds. So the value of the antioxidant activity in the sample in the methanol soluble extract was attributed to the presence of phenolics and other compounds such as steroids, alkaloid, as well as fatty acid and alcohol. Well, thank you very much.